What's up guys, my name is Stranger Danger. I'm here today on my favorite beach to go shelling. If you want to chance it out here, good luck because it is difficult to swim in those waves. Also, I don't recommend chancing it because you could die. Don't come to this beach if you're not an expert swimmer. We are experts, so we know what we're doing. And we're gonna go find some shells and I wanna show it to you guys because I think it'll be fun. If you're new to the channel, guys, make sure you go down and smash the subscribe button and then hit like on this video. If we get a thousand likes on this video, we're gonna be back here later this week, do some more shelling. As long as the waves stay calm, they're a little bit rough and rugged today, but I think we can handle it. I'm here with my friend Brittany and she is a great swimmer out in the ocean. So we're gonna try to get some cool shells out there and I wanna bring you guys along to see what we can get. I think I said everything, let's go find some shells and maybe we'll find some cool stuff too. Okay, see you out there. One more thing I wanna tell you guys, so I'm going full weight to stay all the way down, glued to the bottom. I'm actually gonna take this three pound off. So I have six pounds there without this one and then I'm gonna get this five from Brittany and then give her my other three. So Brittany, how much weight are you gonna have? Is that two one. pounds? Yeah, oh, okay. I'm gonna do five. Okay, so, so she's eight. gonna have five pounds and I'm gonna have 11 pounds on my belt. I'm gonna heavy. be tied to the bottom. So <laughs> small kind drowning risk. I'm gonna be literally walking around down there. But as long as I don't get too tired while I'm up at the surface breathing, then I'll be okay. Cause the longer you stay down, the easier it is to stay down, the more you can, shells you can find. So I think I'm, that's gonna be my secret technique today to find a lot, a lot of shells. What's up, baby? We back. So on this day, I was like, Brittany, the waves are not that big. Let's go shell diving. Bro, the waves don't even move me. And they work, but I have my weight belt. Rock solid on the bottom. So I was all good. And Brittany, uh, I think was swimming okay. Like I said, she's a strong swimmer. So anyways, we got down there, tried to find some shells. Basically what we're looking for is these pockets like this where all of this debris is collecting. And I'm just gonna kinda pick through it and see if there's anything nice looking. Um, and then to find shells, you kinda wanna look, you kinda wanna look for like geometry where it's like following a pattern. Brad, there's some current today, so be careful. It's pushing down. Because all the shells have a beautiful pattern. And so yeah, I had to tell Britt just to be careful. And then finally found the first thing. It's a hair tie. Woohoo. Yay. Back to picking up trash. Oh, round two on the hair tie. Or hair elastic if you're from not the US. And then I found this weird stick. I have no idea what that was for. Oh yeah, that's the stick. The other thing was like a pen or something. And yeah, you can tell the waves are moving me majorly. Um, I thought it would be a lot easier to handle, but like I said before, kind of difficult. Woo, found my first shell, let's go. And then, uh, yep, debris. This bag was dummy thick. It was like so full of sand. And I was trying to get it all out so that I didn't have to carry all the sand with me the whole time. And then I saw this sock too. And I was like, how the heck did a sock and a bag of chips get out here? So if anyone lost their sock and bag of chips, let me know. Cause I have them for you. And the sand looks kind of pretty when you get it out of the bag, I guess. Are you hungry? Cause I got some chips. Oh, nice. Chips and soda. Yeah, so I was cleaning the reef like I do, you know, you know, your boy. Just down there trying to find something. I got two socks so far. Yeah, two socks, one bag, one shell. What the heck, trying to go shell diving, only found trash. More trash, a comb, trash. Forgot my uh, line cutting device, so couldn't get that off. And then there's a spark plug that got fused to a rock. How the heck does that happen? That might be a shell, but who knows? And then we found a uh, lead weight for fishing and maybe another shell. And then I found this fishing hook. So I hooked it into the bag. The water was so murky here. I cannot believe that I found that piece of plastic and bracelet. Another fishing weight. Oh my gosh, I picked up so many weights. We got like at least another pound. I think these are two eight ounces. Oh my gosh, I'm getting a little bit too stuck to the Some bottom. Fish. Now. Another sock. Come on, dude. Who's swimming with socks, anyways? More trash. Can we find some dang shells already? There we go. All right, let's go, baby. Shell City. I'm on fire now. Three shells in a row. Woo! Okay, what's down here? I saw something. Shell. 
Shell, yeah, brother. And then I was like, maybe there's something in this cave. Nope. And this thing was attached to the bottom. I was like, what even kind of string is this? And why is it attached? I had to use my full force to pull it off. Dabbing any luck, Brittany? Dabbing any luck? Is that all shells? Oh my gosh. I am like weighed down because I have so much dive weights and socks, or not dive weights, fishing weights and socks. And I found one shell spot and I got a couple shells. That's it? It's mostly trash. What the heck? Yeah. That thing. Wow, that calorie looks so bright. Frick, all right, stop flexing on me. Okay, I'm gonna follow you and then find your spot and then steal all the shells. Okay, so Brandy was killing it. And then of course I find more trash. And then I think I noticed a shell there, but I had to worry about this first. This seaweed stuff was so stuck to it. I didn't want to take it all with me. So I started pulling this off and then, oh my God, cigarette filter, gross. Okay, seaweed, 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 stick. And that's enough. Ew, band-aid, bandage. Uh, there's Brittany down there, getting it. I was like, okay, I know your secrets now. I told Brittany, feel my sack. That's so heavy, how are you even floating right now? Yeah, I know, did you see when I just sank down? I like stopped kicking so I could pee and I literally dropped down as if I was diving down. Well, I can do it too much without my ear though. That was full air. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even keep my head up to talk to you. Um, I might just try more in summer, inside. Yeah, I was over it. Oh my God, look at this puff boy, he's so big. That's like the size of a small dog. More trash. And then a freaking shirt, what? I was like, bro, who left a whole shirt out here? So all this stuff I had to drag back in, more hair elastic, more plastic, almost missed a shell, got it. Quick draw, got him. Piece of a can, couple more shells on the way in. And now it's time to unload the trash. You guys can see it all. That's that big fishing line mess, the soda or the chip bag and then soda can top, plastic, fiberglass sock, uh, soda and sticker, sock, hair elastic, sock. I don't know, bracelet, miscellaneous. More fishing line stuff. Luckily none of that hit a turtle comb, spark plug attached to a rock, random piece of metal. Probably a fishing weight, but it just got worn down. We saw all of my trash that I pulled out. Uh, we haven't seen my treasure yet. And then Brittany got some trash and mostly treasure I heard. Pretty loaded up bag. All right, let's see what's inside. Um, all right, what you got in there? Thing, I don't know what Big is. piece of fiberglass. And what did they repair this with? Like a wicker chair? <laughs> like, oh my that? gosh. This is a fiberglass surfboard fin. Okay. Cool. This is a fiberglass surfboard fin. Yeah. Nice. Uh, can. Can. If can. Can. Wait, this piece of sea glass. Whoa, that's a big one. That's yeah. like an old school Coke bottle. Yeah, that's cool. Nice. Yeah. Wow, and you got a lot of shells. Dang, that's so much more than me. What the heck, Brittany? Dang, I thought my weight was giving me advantage. It did not help. Or I was just so busy picking up trash. Trick. Whoa, nice one. Dang, okay, you got, what about that super orange one over there? On the left side. Oh, oh okay. I thought I saw one that was like so bright orange. Okay, it must have been that one. I thought I saw like a calorie that was super orange. There is a calorie. I love those, that's so pretty. Yeah, it's like, it would have been purple if it was a little smaller. I don't want to flex on you, Brittany, but I got some pretty, no. I got so few that I can pull them out in one handful. And I wasn't, normally I'm like really selective with what I take. I was not even being selective this time. I just took right here. everything. That's all I got right there, one hand. Oh my gosh, this is probably, yeah, the car is okay. This is probably the least that I've ever gotten 
on a shell dive. I don't know, I was struggling out there. I couldn't find anything. What's up guys, darn it. I just realized that I never made an outro to this video and Brittany was here and she just left so I could have had her in it but I forgot. So it's all good, we'll get her in the next one. Anyways, we had a really good time out there shell diving. Brittany killed it, she got so many beautiful shells and I did not do so well, but I got to clean up the ocean. I always love to put a dent on cleaning up the ocean. It feels so good to me to be out there doing a good job. So if you like this video, make sure you smash the thumbs up on it. Go ahead and subscribe and ring the bell too so you can make sure you see all my videos as soon as they get posted. I'm gonna be doing videos, you know, two or three times a week. So there's always something new to watch on my channel. You're not gonna wanna miss out. We're always out having fun in the ocean. Me and my friend Brittany, some of my other friends, and it's always a good time out there, especially hanging out with my ocean friends like Octavia and the sharks and turtles that I meet along the way. So uh, thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you next time. Bye.